make sure your diver has taken off his shoes, that he's wearing close-fitting, thin clothing, and have him stand straight right over the masking tape on the wall. Uh, you'll need an object that has two straight edges. You can use a binder or a board. Um, in this case, we're using a set square. For this measurement, I'm going to ask you to move over just a little bit. So I have the tape right about at the level of the diver's shoulder. And now you're going to use your same tool or object, and you're going to place it right where the neck meets the shoulder. It's usually about where the collar of the t-shirt stands, um, but just make sure that you find that place and square it on the, driver's sh the diver's shoulder and square it to the wall, and then you're going to mark that level. And let's do the other side, just for fun. So if you can move over, perfect. And then just move a little bit, okay. And then you're gonna place it in the same place. Sometimes you'll have a difference between the two shoulders, but oh, you're actually pretty straight. And mark on the wall again. Ask your diver to position the object between their legs so the top edge is, sits comfortably in their crotch. So how does it feel there? Good. So at the right height? Mm -hmm. And then make sure that the object is squared to the wall as well as at the right height for the diver. Does that feel good? Yep. Okay, now if you have someone here who can help you, I, I prefer to use three people, but if there's just the two of you, ask the diver to hold the object with their legs. Can you do that? Mm -hmm. Make sure the diver is not looking down. Does that height still feel okay? Yep. If the diver is looking down or trying to hold the object, it will, the measurement may change. So when the object is squared, then you can hold, and can you just step forward just a tiny bit? Perfect. So as your diver steps forward, you can reach behind them and mark the wall. Okay, and now you can release. Okay, and step forward. Now, with the marks you have on the wall, you may step away. These will be your vertical measurements from the second mark to the third mark is your vertical torso length.